Hello adventurers and welcome to Friday. Well, it's going to be sunny, but I think rather pensive today. Your emotional focus continues to be your intellect, so your emotions and intellect are working side by side. And the next 24 hours, I predict that your emotions will kind of expand a bit. In other words, you're going to feel richer, you're going to feel wider, and it's going to go along with your intellect. So I can't describe what this would actually come down to in your life because gosh knows what you're dealing with. But I do think that in the end of the weekend, you're going to find that you feel a lot more rich when it comes to your emotions and your intellect and your prowess. That's because the moon is crossing Jupiter, Neptune, and Chiron. At the same time, you'll probably heal a bit from old intellectual wounds, like maybe someone called you stupid when you were a kid, and maybe you always thought you never could be smart enough, those types of things. I think you'll be letting go of some of those things as the moon crosses. Zimmer on the sun, we're at the end of chapter two now of Sun and Cancer. Mars is ruling the day, which means that it's time to act. Act on what? Well, for you, it comes down to long-term, uh, excuse me, intimacy and trust issues. Gosh, 12 signs, sometimes I get them all confused. You are working on this month, changing your boundaries. And maybe part of that emotional expansion is tied to you changing your boundaries. And by Mars ruling the day, it's time to actually act on one of those boundaries. So if you decided that you're not gonna spend anymore, well then act on it, don't spend anymore. If you decide you're not gonna tolerate a certain person treating you badly, well then act on it. Tell them no, put up that hand and stop sign. Show them, show them to the side. Either way, act and show the universe that you are, in fact, serious. Now, through the weekend, I predict the Sagittarius will be nesting and resting. The moon is moving into Pisces, so your emotional focus will be on kind of recharging your batteries. Great weekend to invest in your home and your family and your foundation. On Sunday, there is a little bit of a risk of falling into an old emotional booby trap that maybe you worrying about your survival, maybe you worrying about something, and maybe you freaking out about your career because the two are tied. Just be careful. That is predicted by the solar system. The point is not to fall into that. Then, lastly, we have a new new episode of The Urban Mystic with Skip Jennings live today. Skip's going to get deep on Chapter 2 of Sun and Cancer and help people get past this last stage. He's a very spiritual philosopher. He's an awesome guru and he's got great words of wisdom. So I really recommend you check him out. He goes live today and is live through the weekend. All right, that's all I have for the weekend forecast. I'll see you, Sages, on Monday with more Live, Love, Be. So cold.